Magnify you, you are our Father, you are our rock. We have come from all across the nations of the earth. We have come to say thank you, our Father. We have come to call upon you. We have not come to seek a man. We have come to seek your face. And we thank you because you have guaranteed us that when we call upon you, you will answer us. We give you the glory and the praise. Thank you for the great and mighty things you've been doing in our midst. Thank you for the healings. Thank you for the miracles. Thank you for the breakthroughs. Thank you for the deliverances. Thank you for the turnarounds. Thank you for the open doors. We give you the glory and the praise. We honor your majesty. We subscribe to your grace. We subscribe to your goodness. We subscribe to your majesty. We subscribe to your sovereignty. We subscribe to your might. We subscribe to your ability. We subscribe to the fact that with you all things are possible. We have come before you our God. We have come before you our rock. We have never had to seek you in vain. Our God we thank you for constantly showing up on this platform. For constantly making yourself available. Healing the sick setting the captives free breaking the chains of darkness overturning and overriding the counsels of wickedness we thank you for causing our souls to escape we are grateful opening the womb of the parent causing the parent to conceive causing the pregnant to deliver safely sustaining the pregnancies of your children preserving your children on the highway what a mighty God you are. We honor your majesty. We thank you, our Father. Our eyes look up to you, Father. Like the eyes of the children look up to their parents. And you said they are not ashamed. All them that appear before you in Zion, our faces will not be ashamed. We go from strength to strength. We go from glory to glory. We go from might to might. We go from dimensions to dimensions. Thank you for breakthroughs. Thank you for open doors. This is another day that you have made. And we will rejoice and we will be glad in it. Somebody's break is in today. Somebody's turn around is in this day. Somebody's turn around is in today. Somebody's favor is in today. We give you the glory. Hallelujah. We honor you, our Father. Hallelujah. Let your name forever be praised. Amen. In the name that is above every other name. Amen. Even the name that guarantees answers all the yes. time. Uh -huh. The name of the resurrected. Jesus, the matchless one. Amen. We give you the praise, our Father. Hallelujah. Let every tongue begin to praise ah, him. You, In Jesus. your room, begin to give him praise. You, In your house, begin to give him praise. Thank you. Thank him, thank him, and praise him, my God. Look at where he has brought you from, and let your praise ascend to his throne. It is how to access the presence of God. Give him the praise. Give him the glory. Give him the adoration. We give you the glory. We give you the praise. Thank you, our Father. Everybody, go ahead now. Begin to type and declare who you call your God. How big is your God? How wonderful is your God? Who do you call your God? Whatever you call him to be, that is who we will be to you. My rock, my fortress, my defense, my hiding place, the lifter up of my head, the God of my difficult places, the God on the mountain, the God in the valley, the God in the waters, my fourth man in the fire, my storm catcher, the God who calms my winds. Blessed be your name. Give him the glory if you will. Thank you, O God. 
Shikila to prande de basteriando. Rapa no frate colientos. Ishento frina manseliesta. Nutu prante le cozia. Rapa no se le grasto liento brasta. Shkanto lo cuse la presia. Irritombre quita la lande mia. Zelto men cotuse la brasti. Kutemande le cozia. Ile nom roto vrietas. Le I hear somebody calling him the reliable God. I hear somebody calling him the dependable God. I hear somebody calling him the faithful God. I hear somebody calling him the matchless God. I hear somebody calling him the warrior of Israel. I hear somebody calling him the God of Jeshurun. The God who rides upon the wings of the heavens for your help. The lion of the tribe of Judah. Belinda said is greater than the greatest. My God, I give you praise. Michael said he's the mighty one in battle. We give you the praise. Philomena said he's a great warrior. Give him the praise. Who is your God? How big is your God? How mighty is your God? Shana Kosieta. Irapento Fratana Glosieta. Ano Framino Ziela Kupretende. Hanto for a Susto Pratia. Nicotenda Rapenos Taligraste. Stamanon Telia. To Brando Fredia. Nicotos Canamendo Lia Supredia. Here in Conga Lieta. He Shanda Labacosia. You may say he's an awesome God. Blessed be your name, our God. Blessed be your name, our rock. In Jesus' mighty name, we'll pray. Amen. I, I don't know who you are, but, but listen to me. I think I need to start quickly here because today we have a lot to deal with that the Lord has shown me in the place of prayer. We're going to be dealing with a lot today. So call your friends and your family members. You don't want them to miss out on what God is about to do today. And I need to hit the ground running on a prophetic level that the Lord is saying to me, you are having divine exemption. Amen. Uh, I don't know what it is, but the Lord is saying, when the situation happens, you will know that you were exempted. Amen. You will be exempted. Amen. Something is about to happen. And I hear the Lord saying divine exemption. Amen. He said, begin to thank me for divine exemption. Amen. You have been exempted. Amen. You have been exempted. Amen. I don't know who you are. Oh. Whatever it is that is about to catch up with everybody, whatever it is that is about to happen to people around you, the Lord said you are exempted. Amen. If you know you are the one I'm speaking to, begin to say, Father, I thank you for divine exemption. Call your friends, call your brother, call your sister. I don't, God needs to cover them in this meeting. Hear me and hear me well. Call your loved ones. I speak by the Spirit of God. Invite your loved ones. God wants to put a covering on your family members. I hear the Lord saying, begin to thank me for divine exemption. You will understand it better by and by. Somebody will be exempted. Something is about to happen in the office and you will be exempted. Amen. Something is about to happen in the neighborhood and you will be exempted. Something is about to happen in the business place, in the workplace, in the marketplace and I hear you will be exempted. Under the highway, you will be exempted. On the byway, you will be exempted. In the airways, you will be exempted. 
I hear the Lord saying, begin to praise me for divine exemption. When I see the blood, I will pass over you. I will pass over you. You will be exempted. You will be exempted. Your family will be exempted. Your children will be exempted. Begin to give him praise. Begin to give him praise. Le poro fantos. Scalebrando. Supranandes. Frigadas cotia. Il mambradesto. Cote la pam pretasia. In Jesus' name we pray. For somebody watching right now, the Spirit of the Lord is saying, I should tell you. That, 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 that the sickness that you are having, they have told you that naturally people don't escape it. Uh, they tell you that people no, people don't survive it. Uh, they tell you that normally the chances of survival usually is very, very slim. But the Lord said, I should tell you, not only will you survive it, you will thrive. Amen. The Lord said you have been exempted. Amen. This same thing that takes people's lives has meant a life it can't take. Amen. Your life will not be cut short. Amen. Your life will not be cut short. Amen. HIV will not take you out. Amen. Cancer will not take you out. Amen. Cancer will not take you out. Amen. Tumor in the brain will not take you out. Amen. This heart condition will not take you out. Amen. Will not take your child out. Amen. Will not take your loved one out. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Somebody say, my father, my father. My father my say, father. I thank you. I thank you. Because I am exempted. Because I'm exempted. Woo. I'm exempted. Because I'm exempted. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you because I'm exempted. Take I'm exempted in the name of Jesus. Uh, I'm exempted in the name of Repenos. Jesus. I'm exempted in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I'm exempted 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 in the name of Jesus. Doris, you are exempted. Amen. Jetrud. You are exempted. Amen. Patricia, you are exempted. Amen. Jonah, you are exempted. Amen. Marvis, you are exempted. Amen. Fumi, you are exempted. Amen. Maureen, you are exempted. Amen. Listen to me. I'm hearing a different thing now. Listen. The Lord said nobody in your bloodline has escaped it. Everybody in your bloodline has been a victim of a particular thing. Has been a victim of a particular experience. Your father suffered it. Your mother suffered it. Your uncle suffered it. Your siblings are suffering it. Nobody in the bloodline has escaped this situation. But I hear the Lord saying, your own soul has escaped. Amen. You are exempted. Amen. And I hear the Lord saying, because you are exempted, others are coming out with you. Amen. Others are coming out with you. Amen. Others are coming out with you. Amen. You are exempted from generational limitation. Amen. You are exempted Amen. from generational reproach. Amen. You are exempted yes. from generational pain. Amen. You are exempted Amen. from generational affliction. Amen. You are exempted Amen. from generational poverty. Amen. You are exempted Amen. from generational spirit of servitude. Amen. You are exempted oh. From generational spirit of poverty, Amen. you are exempted. Amen. Somebody say, my father, my father, my father, my father. I, thank you I thank you because, you, because you, because you are exempted. 
because I am exempted. Go ahead and give him praise. In the mighty name of Jesus, thank you, Father. I'm exempted. I'm exempted. In the name of Jesus. Maya, Maya, you are exempted. In the name of Jesus Christ. Caroline, you are exempted. In the name of Jesus. Akin, you are exempted. In the name of Jesus, Marie, you are exempted. In the name of Jesus Christ, Beverly, you are exempted. In the name of Jesus, Neoma, you are exempted. Shisom, you are exempted. Olawale, you are exempted. Martha, you are exempted. From the day, you are exempted. Whatever runs loose, you are free from it. You are free from it. Amen. Lemon on Decalosiata. Lona, you are exempted. Amen. Umqueta, you are exempted. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Pastor Shago, I'm hearing clearly in my spirit. Tell my son, the time has come. Amen. The time has come. Amen. You know you are the one as I mentioned what I'm about to mention. Tell my daughter. The time has come. Amen. I can see it written boldly. Boldly. I see it written on the massive placard. Promotion. Amen. Promotion. Amen. Promotion. Amen. Elevation. Amen. The time has come. If you are the one that has been waiting for it, begin to give God praise. Receive it with thanksgiving. Receive it with thanksgiving. And it will be given to you. Receive it with thanksgiving. And it will be given to you. And you will have it. Receive it. It will be given. And you will have it. Receive it. It will be given. And you will have it. Promotion. Elevation. You are stepping up. God is stepping you up. God is stepping you up. God is stepping you up. The grace for step up is upon you now. The step up grace is upon you. The step up anointing is upon you. Who am I praying for? Receive it now. Receive it now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you for the promotion. Thank you for the promotion. Thank you for the promotion. Call your husband. Call your brother. Tell your brother it's promotion time. It's elevation time. Amen. Mark, mark, listen, mark my words. Mark my words. These are no empty words. We pray to receive them. And we declare as we have been given. We are not adding to it. We are not subtracting. Hear me and hear me well. As I hear the Lord, so I speak to you. I saw clearly promotion. Amen. Elevation. Amen. And your testimony will come to confirm Amen. it. Amen. It will happen in a strange way. Amen. It will happen against resistance. Amen. It will happen against manipulation. Amen. God is stepping you up. Amen. God is upscaling you. Amen. God is upgrading you. Amen. Your ministry is about to be promoted. Amen. Your ministry is coming on a higher platform. Amen. Your voice is about to be heard on a higher platform. Amen. Your assignment is about to be celebrated on a higher platform. Amen. Somebody type and declare. If you know you are the one, type and declare. It's my season of promotion. It's my season of promotion. It's promotion time. It's promotion time. It's my season. It's my season. It's my season of promotion. In the name of Jesus, uplift me. It's promotion time. It's promotion time. It's promotion time. It's promotion time. It's promotion Promotion. Patricia. Promotion. Michael. Promotion. In the name of Jesus. They will fight against it, but they shall not prosper. Amen. 
they will walk against it. But it is in vain. Please hear me and hear me well. I said, as I see, they will fight against your promotion. But it is in vain. Amen. They will manipulate the system against you, but it will fail. Amen. They will campaign against you, but it will hold no water. Amen. They will hire counselors against your lifting, but it shall not prosper. Amen. As I'm speaking, begin to rise. Amen. As I'm speaking, begin to rise. Amen. Grace is upon you now. Amen. Receive grace to rise. Amen. Receive grace to rise. Amen. The grace of the God who called me begin to make you rise. Amen. The grace that performs miracles on this altar begin to make you rise. Amen. Your case will not be different. Amen. Shay, call it. Your case will not be different. Amen. Tricia, your case will not be different. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. you are going up. Amen. No force will stop you. Amen. No power will stop you. Amen. No necromancer will stop you. Amen. No sorcerer will stop you. Amen. No diviner will stop you. Amen. No collaboration will stop you. Amen. No alliance will stop you. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hear me and hear me well. You will be strangely promoted. Amen. Strangely elevated. Amen. Strangely invited. Amen. You will not be qualified for what God is about to do. Let me speak in parables. For me, for me, if you are hearing me, I speak over your organization. That the contention over your organization in your space, the contention is over as I speak. I just saw it. The contention over your organization is over. Every businessman, every businesswoman, every CEO that has a company that is being contended against in your sector, being contended against in your space from today, your enterprise will begin to work stronger. Your contenders will begin to get weaker. You will get stronger. They will get weaker. You will get stronger. They will get weaker. You will get stronger. They will get weaker. Type and declare. Type and declare. It's my season of laughter. It's my season of celebration. It's my season of promotion. It's my season of exemption. Give him praise. Thank you, Jesus. It's my season. It's my season. Season of laughter. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You need to hear me. I'm hearing this. Strange helpers will begin to come from strange places to do strange things in your life. You will be strangely assisted. You will be strangely assisted in the name of Jesus. Strange assistance from strange people coming in your direction in a strange way. You will be strangely assisted. You will be strangely assisted. You will remember this. It will be a strange assistance from a strange person in a strange way. It is your portion. Keep on sharing. Strange help. Strange assistance. Strange help. Irandoviata. Destiny help us. Coming in a strange way to help you, to lift you, to turn your life around. Yinka, you will be strangely assisted. Susan, you will be strangely assisted. Makufra Dabiata, non kete salakushapa. Yes, sir. In the name of Jesus. Oluchi, you will be strangely assisted. 
you will be strangely assisted in the name of Jesus. My prophet, I see it turning around. I see it turning around. I'm seeing things spinning around. And I'm asking the Lord, what minute this? And the Lord is saying, tell my son, tell my daughter, I'm turning it around. I'm turning it around. It will be like a dream. It will appear to be unreal. I'm turning it around. There's a turnaround. Rolls, I'm turning it around. Unis, I'm turning it around. Quicks, I'm turning it around. Ilanon Jacadea, you are in your turnaround season. You are in your turnaround moment. Somebody say, my father, my father. I receive my turnaround. Femi, let there be a turnaround. In the name of Jesus. Edith, let there be turn around. In the name of Jesus. Francis, let there be turn around. In the name of Jesus. Althea, let there be turn around. In the name of Jesus. Mercy, let there be turn around. In the name of Jesus. Dorcas, turn around. Dorcas. It is turning around. Amen. It is turning around. Amen. Julie, it is turning around. Amen. Sophie, it is turning around. Amen. Sophia, it is turning around. Iranto Fiata of Baje, it is turning around. Amen. Anita, it is turning around. Idemutia, it is turning around. Leparo Fiatesa, Supranancote La Casta. Somebody type and declare. It's my turn around season. Gershin, it is turning around. Kucheli, it is turning around. Sapramo Viatesa. La Fronto Copesiata. In Jesus' name we pray. Ah, this is very important now. Please call your friends, call your sisters. And as you do so, the God of heaven will honor you. As you share far and wide, you will go far and wide. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hear me and hear me well. I saw you in the place of prayer. I saw you in the place of prayer. You were brought to me by revelation. You were in the pool of regrets. You were in the pool of regrets. You were drowning in regrets. You were drowning in pain. Looking back at the opportunities, the privileges, and the connections you have lost. They have come your way. It's not that you don't have connections. It's not that privileges have not come. It's not that opportunities have not come. But you can't explain why. Your life is still like this. With all the connections you have. The privileges you've had. And the opportunities you've had. You are in the pool of regrets. And you are asking yourself. Will I ever make it again? You are wondering. If God can ever show you mercy again. You are asking. If God can ever turn it around again. Well, thus saith the Spirit of the Lord, I will visit you again. Amen. I will visit you again. Amen. And I will restore to you the years that the canker worm have taken. Amen. The years that the locusts have taken. Amen. I hear the Lord said, I'm restoring it. Amen. I'm restoring it. Amen. I'm restoring lost opportunities. Amen. I'm restoring lost privileges. Amen. Somebody say, my father, my father. My father my say, father. Restore. Restore. Restore, restore, again. restore again. Restore again. 
begin to praise him. In the name of Jesus, Say it. Declare it with your mouth. Restore it again. Restore it again. Push alamante. Kuperi endosh. Pomandolos. Karondi yata. Profenendes. Kuliprandes. Kapalata. In Jesus' name we pray. Please, if you are the one. You have lost opportunity. God blessed you with opportunities. You are single. God blessed you with opportunities to have been married. You had privileges. There are people, business people. You had connections. But you just look back now. They were wasted opportunities. Wasted connections. Wasted privileges. The Lord said I should tell you. Place your right hand on the screen. I will have mercy upon you again and I will restore to you Amen. the privileges, Amen. the opportunities Amen. and the connections Amen. that you have lost. Amen. And I hear the Lord say they will be bigger and better. Amen. And I hear the Lord say you will not miss them. Amen. This time around you will not miss them. Amen. This time around you will not miss them. Amen. In the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. I speak restoration Amen. of opportunities, Amen. restoration Amen. of privileges, Amen. restoration Amen. of connections. Amen. If you are the one, say a big amen. amen. Who will say that Sarah, who will say that Elizabeth has conceived when she had lost her opportunity. You didn't hear me now. Marakata yata. There was a time. Hear me and hear me well. There was a time in the life of Sarah when she had the opportunity to conceive. It was between her early years as a young girl and age maybe 50 or 60. But she has crossed 70. She was already 90. Elizabeth was stricken in years. They have lost the opportunity. But there is a God. There is a God. Ah, when I saw it, I screamed. There is a God who can restore opportunities, privileges and connections in a bigger and better way. Who would have thought that a woman that did not have a child very early in her life will now have a prophet to the nation. Yeah. Can I say to you, what is coming now yes. will be bigger than what you had thought you should have had. Amen. I speak over your life. What is coming now will be bigger than what you have ever imagined. I, if you are the one receiving it, kneel down in your house and receive it. Put your right hand on your head. If you want to put the phone on yourself, make a point of contact. I speak over your life. They said you have lost your time. They said you've missed opportunities. They said it can't happen to you again. But I speak by the God of Abraham, by the God of Jacob, by the God of Isaac, that in the name of Jesus, what you lost when you were young, God will do it bigger and better. Amen. Please call your friends. Hear me anywhere. You are watching me. You are watching me. Seleka to nietapa. Prove ni entus kaladis. Foronto ki kale mrande si la ko prate nieta. Enan no vie kaladus se prante vas. Tela no kretedia. Contenda 
Hemenon to fia te la cosetantia. Porno fediato le cate prate di asosa liata. Fermo non sicatea. Sica te la sopia. Listen to me carefully. They said to you, Can it happen now? They said it to your face. They said if it should have happened, it should have happened when you were 24, 35, but not now. But thus saith the Spirit of the Lord, what men have called impossible, Amen. I hear the Lord say, watch how I turn it around. Amen. I hear the Lord saying, I should tell you that what they have said cannot happen. In this season, I am making it happen. Amen. 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 Opportunities you have lost, they are coming back in a big way. Amen. But please permit me. Permit me to use secular events to speak to you. The only event I can use is Joe Biden. A man tried to become a president when he was young when everybody should actually vote for him he missed it he was not elected president he, he ended up his career political career as a vice president he went into retirement because in his mind I cannot become a president again why is God talking to me about people that, that are saying it can't happen again? They said you can't carry a baby again. Who is God? Who is it that say a thing? Yes. And it comes to pass when God has not spoken. Shamanti Abela, Oye Funke, whosoever told you that it will not happen, that is not God. The man is not God. God is not a man. Man is not God. What man has said shall begin to fail in your life. What men have said shall not happen will begin to fail in your life. The words of my God shall begin to come to pass in your life. The counsel of God shall begin to come to pass in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Say, do it again. Do it again. Say, do it again. Do it again. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Do it again. In the mighty name of Woo! Jesus. Do it again. Do it again. In the mighty name of Shashi. Jesus. Do it again. Do it again. In the mighty name of Jesus. Do it again. In the mighty name of Jesus. Do it again. 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 Call your family member. Your family member. In Jesus' name. Amen. I want to pray. See, listen to me. This is a burden in my spirit. You have had things. There's somebody watching me. It is even yourself. When you look at too many mistakes you've made in your life. Too many wrong decisions. It's like you have wasted opportunities. You have wasted privileges. And you are saying to yourself, can it ever happen again? Will I ever? There's another one I'm seeing. You are seeing them, they've gone ahead of you. And you are asking yourself, can I ever catch up again? Can I ever catch up again? In ministry, can I ever catch up? They have gone ahead of me. But for say the spirit of the Lord, you will not only catch up, you will overtake. Amen. You will overtake. Amen. You will overtake. Amen. What you lost is coming back. Amen. It's coming oh. bigger and better. Amen. It's coming bigger and better. Amen. Your health will bounce back. Amen. They said, oh, oh. hear me and hear me well. Did I not hear the doctor say that, that if you had come earlier, that your case would have been different? But that you came late. And because of that, uh, we are sorry there's nothing we can do. In the name of Jesus, 
I decree and I declare yes. that because the doctors have taken off their hands from your case, because they have signed out, because the doctor says it's impossible, I command that situation to be turned around now. Yes, amen. Be healed in your body. Amen. Be healed of that disease. Amen. Be healed of that disorder. Amen. Neurological disease be healed. Uh, amen. Neurological disorder be healed. Amen. Cerebral issues be healed. Amen. Spinal issues be healed. Amen. Heart condition be healed. Amen. Bone problems be healed. Amen. Menstrual issues be healed. Amen. Chest congestions be healed. Amen. Muscular degeneration be healed. Amen. Multiple sclerosis be healed. Amen. Hypertension be healed. Amen. Diabetes be healed. Amen. Every form of Alzheimer's be healed. Amen. Every form of pain in the legs be healed. Amen. The part of your body that you've not been able to use, begin to use now. Amen. Begin to use now. Amen. Begin to use now. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Please share the video. Invite your friends. There's a, there's a strong anointing here. Check your body. As you are sharing the video, check your body. People have been healed everywhere, everywhere. I just received a witness. The anointing just reached you. You just got healed. And as you notice you are healed, type, I am healed. I am healed. Type it. And as you type, you are healed. You are made whole. You are made whole. Amen. You are made whole. Amen. Every person that is healed now, type I am healed. I'm and healed as you type it, you are made whole. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I hear the Lord saying in Jeremiah 30, 17, I am giving you back your health. Amen. Right now, I'm giving you back your health Amen. right now. Amen. Receive your health back Amen. right now. Amen. Receive your health back right now. Amen. I'm hearing the Father saying, I'm taking from you now. That thing that is hurting you, something is hurting you. Something is causing you hurts. I hear the Lord saying, I'm taking it out of your body now. I'm taking it out of your body now. Amen. You are sensing it leaving your body. That thing that is hurting you is leaving you now in Jesus. Your wounds have been healed. Your wounds have been healed. Your wounds have been healed. Pastor Shagun, there are people with wounds. Different kinds of wounds. Ulcer wounds. Ulcers. Wounds in the stomach. Wounds in the mouth. Dry up. Amen. I said dry up. Amen. Wounds be healed. Amen. Wounds be healed. Amen. Within 24 hours. I command your wound to be healed. Amen. There are wounds in the private parts. Wound be healed. Amen. I said wound be healed. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I'm not fratekaba. I command every pain, every source of pain in your body right now. Be healed. Amen. The God who heals on this altar is in your space now. Yes, amen. Healing you right now. Amen. Making you whole right now. Amen. In the name of Jesus amen. Christ. Amen. This is going to be very strange. Don't miss it. I want to pray for somebody right now. Pastor Shago, there's something God showed me I've never seen before in my 31 years of reading the scripture, the Lord spoke to me and he said, son, I will be leading my children out of trouble. I said, Lord, I, said, Lord, I don't understand. And the Lord showed me Psalm 23 in verse 1. He said, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. In verse 3, he said, he restored my soul. He leadeth me. Can I know see a time? Yes. But then in Psalm 31, in verse 3 to 4, NLT version, the Bible says, you are my rock and my fortress. For the honor of your name, lead me out of danger. 
for the honor of your oh. name, lead me out of danger. Please call your friends, call your sister. This is your last day in trouble. This is your last day in shame. This is your last moment in poverty. This is your last moment in disgrace. This is your last moment in setback. From today, begin to rise. Begin to rise. Begin to rise. Begin to rise. Listen carefully. He said, restore, you restored my soul. You lead me in. Please watch this. He said, you lead me in. But then in chapter 31, verse 4, in verse 3, he said, you lead me out. Lead me in the way I should go. Lead me out of what I am in. Can I prophesy by this revelation? Put your hands on the screen. If you are in any situation, if you are in any circumstances, not by my words, but by the word we have just read, God is not a man that he should lie. He's not the son of man that he should repent. He's holding you by the hand. You are coming out of this. You are coming out of this. He said in Psalm 31 verse 4, verse 3, you lead me out of danger. You are coming out of it today. Amen. You are coming out of it today. Amen. The Lord lead you out of poverty. Amen. The Lord lead you out of indebtedness. Amen. Who am I praying for? You can make contact with the screen. The anointing with the word is transferred to your life. Amen. I said from this moment, the Lord lead you out of poverty. Amen. The Lord lead you out of shame. Amen. The Lord lead you out of reproach. Amen. The Lord lead you out of setback. Amen. The Lord lead you out of limitation. Amen. The Lord lead you out of reproach. Amen. Somebody say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Say, lead me out. Lead me out. Mention what you want him to lead you out of. Mention it. Say, my father, my father, lead me out of this situation. Lead me out, oh God, of this disease. Lead me out, oh God, of this virus. Lead me out, oh God, of this virus. Lead me out, oh God, of this virus. Call upon him. Say, my father, my father, lead me out. Lead me out of this situation. Lead me out of this danger. Put fratica down. You are coming out. You are coming out of it. 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 In the name of Jesus. You are coming out of it. He's leading you out of it. In Jesus' name we pray. Please invite your friends and get your anointing oil ready. I want to speak over the anointing oil in your house. If you have no anointing oil, get granite oil. Get, get palm oil. Get anything oil. By any means, get Vaseline. Get baby oil. Something must happen to you today. The word of God cannot fail. Yes, sir. Please put that scripture on the screen. The NLT version. Mama Sophie Catelia. It is on the screen. Please, everybody, keep your eyes on the screen. He said, You are my rock. You are my fortress. For the honor of your name, lead me out of danger. Father, this is not a miracle you should do because of my faith because of your name they know me as your child they know me as your daughter they know me as a pastor they know me as a pastor's wife 
Every servant of God, every serving child of God that is suffering reproach from today, the Lord lead you out of it. The Lord hold you by the hand and lead you out of this mess. Lead you out of this reproach. Say, my father, my father. Say, hold me by the hand. Lead me out of this. From today, lead me out of poverty. Every waiting couple, every couple waiting for conception from today, the Lord lead you out of barrenness. Every person watching me, trusting God for a job, the Lord lead you out of joblessness. Every CEO trusting God for mega contracts, the Lord lead you out of waiting. Contract upon contract, begin to receive it. Contract upon contract, begin to receive in the name of Jesus. Listen, don't miss this. Get your anointing oil ready. Marakote la I want to show, share something with you now. It is very important. This is very crucial. Listen carefully. In Psalm 23, in verse 3, he said, He leadeth me in the path. Uh-huh. Please don't miss it. Too. Prayer must be complete. He leadeth me in the path. Uh-huh of righteousness. So he can lead me in the path of anything. He can lead me in the path of wealth creation. He can lead me in the path of success. He can lead me in the path of conception. But for him to lead me in, he has to lead me out. He led them out of Egypt. He led them out of captivity. He led them to their promised land. Somebody, I give you 60 seconds. You will say, my father, my father. Lead me out of. You will mention the thing. Lead me out of poverty. Lead me into prosperity. Lead me out of sin. Lead me into righteousness. Lead me out of begging. Lead me into lending. Open your mouth 60 seconds. Type it. It is happening in your life. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we pray for every waiting mother, every couple waiting on God for conception. In the name of Jesus, your womb is open. Amen. Your womb is open. Amen. Spam count rise. Amen. Spam health rise. Amen. Spam motility rise. Amen. I decree conception. Amen. In Jesus' mighty and matchless name. Amen. I want to pray right now in the name of Jesus and remind you if you have an urgent need for prayer, somebody's waiting on our prayer line to pray with you. Call that number right now. Somebody's waiting to pray with you. You have an urgent need for prayer. Call the number on the screen in the name of Jesus. Send in your testimony of what God is doing via text, audio, or video. Preferably, send us your video today. Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for everyone today. And I decree your mercy and your grace expressed over our lives. In Jesus the Christ, mighty and matchless name we pray. Amen.